Mets reportedly reach two-year deal with 3B Todd Frazier. The Mets added some instant pop to their lineup Monday. Reportedly reaching a deal with free agent third baseman Todd Frazier. Frazier, who turns 32 on February 12, had hinted on Twitter Sunday the Mets were his likely destination. Ken Rosenthal of The Athletic reports that Frazier and the Mets have agreed to a two-year $17 million contract. Frazier struggled at the plate last season. Slashing .213, .344, .428 in 474 at-bats between the White Sox and the Yankees. But the two-time All-Star has proven power. He hit 40 home runs in 2016, and 175 homers in six full MLB seasons. The addition of Frazier fills the void at third base the Mets have had the past three seasons. With seven-time All-Star David Wright hampered by injuries. Wright, who missed the entire 2017 season with a variety of ailments told MLB.com in January he's not ready to retire yet. He underwent rotator cuff surgery last September. Mets manager Mickey Callaway has some different options to explore on the left side of the infield, but the most likely scenario we'll see is Drubal Cabrera moving from third to second base, with 22-year-old Amd Rosario getting the full-time job at short. Jose Reyes would be the utility infielder. Frazier, who turns 32 next Monday, saved 10 runs at third base this past season. According to Fangraphs.com. That ranked fourth among third basemen. And ahead of strong defenders like Baltimore's Manny Machado and Washington's Anthony Rendon. The veteran also will provide the team with another strong presence in the clubhouse following a season in which the Mets lacked leadership down the stretch. Frazier ignited the Yankees' thumbs down rally last year that became a viral sensation. Frazier also gives the Mets righty power. And he has mashed 131 homers over the past four seasons. He hit .213 while tallying 27 homers last year with the White Sox and Yankees. And also posted a career-best .344 on base percentage. The former Rutgers star will serve as the Mets' starting third baseman. And as Drubal Cabrera will take over as the starting second baseman. Cabrera originally had been slated to start at third base but he recently said he would prefer to play second base. Cabrera cost the Mets six runs at second base last year according to Fangraphs.com. October 11, 2017, Cleveland, Ohio, USA, New York Yankees. October 11, 2017, Cleveland, Ohio, USA. New York Yankees third baseman Todd Frazier, 29, celebrates after defeating the Cleveland Indians during Game 5 of the 2017 ALDS Playoff Baseball Series at Progressive Field. Mandatory credit, David Richard USA Today Sports, photo, David Richard. David Richard USA Today Sports. In acquiring Frazier, the Mets checked off a major item on their to-do list since they had long been searching for a starting infielder. The team recently brought back Jose Reyes. But the ideal scenario is for him to serve as a utility bench player. The Mets had considered other players such as Eduardo Nunez, Neil Walker and Josh Harrison but Frazier always seemed like the best fit among that group. This move continues what has been a busy offseason for the Mets. And they have now spent roughly $73 million this offseason. Most teams have not spent much this winter and it's contributed to the slow market. But the Mets have been rather active.
The Mets plan has been to be patient and see if there are value deals to be made. And the strategy has paid off. Frazier's deal is a solid investment for the Mets. And they also resigned Jay Bruce at a value price considering he swatted 36 homers last year. The team's payroll is in the $145 to $150 million range. It's possible the Mets can still make another move this offseason since the team will continue to monitor the market for potential value. With spring training starting shortly, players may have to settle for lesser deals than they had originally hoped. While the Mets have been linked to starting pitchers recently, sources have maintained all offseason that adding a starting pitcher is not a priority for the team. However, it's possible the team may find a quality pitcher for a low-cost deal in this market.